how you guys doing anyway mostly this is just mostly like my live streaming channel but whatever it is all right anyway i had a video up saying how to permanently fix an atomizer short for my vape pen or whatever you guys want to call it basically there's a short in the system you just gotta figure out where it's at unit coil water in your atomizer whatever the deal is leak in your atomizer anyway I was online and I was going to buy some new coils because I don't have an RBA unit yet. And I'm thinking about getting it maybe this week. Depends if I can find a kit so I can make the coils myself. All right. But for smoke, smock, whatever you want to call it, they're coil heads. Somebody said, oh, the singular coil is the best. FYI, that's the one that gave me my atomizer short because something wrong with the coil. Somebody said this one was the best, the one with the two heads. And then somebody said that. This one was the best. One with the four heads. I gotta tell you guys this. Whatever your preference is, that's gonna be your preference. There is no best. Alright? The best just is what am I gonna say? I forgot the word I was gonna use, but anyway. Everybody has their own criteria of the best. For me, I personally prefer this one the one with the four coils i've this the one at the four coils it says best at 60 to 80 watts and 0.15 ohms and it can support from anywhere to 50 to 110 watts normally i don't vape above 60 but i use this one today just to try it out yeah there's two missing right um, one, I don't know what happened to it. The other one's in my unit right now. Anyway, I used it. And this one, vaping at like 50, and this one supports up to, I'm not sure if you guys can see it. It says best between 45 and 60. Well, I was pulling out, pull, doing pulls at 55 and 50. And already it smelled like, well, not smell, it tasted like the coils were burning out. It's a brand new coil. Um, all I gotta say is, try them all out. If you guys, the coils aren't that expensive. Just buy the singular pack. Try them out. See which ones are you, which ones you prefer. It's just a personal preference. That's all it is. All right. That's for unit personal preference as well. But for me, I'm changing to this one. Now, as for e juice. This is the brand I I like using, but not Killerberry. I use I like the blueberry one. It's called Blueberry Slushy. This one's just the Killberry. And Killberry, I don't like the taste that much, but I know sometimes I mix the blueberry slushy with this one. But we're gonna jump off camera for a second. As for this one, this one is brand by Lucy's. This is this one is called what? Blueberry Dazzle. Blueberry Dazzle, aka blueberry pie. This is the nastiest shit I ever tasted, man. The first night, I was like, mm, okay, it's good. But after the third pull, I was like, Bleh. And I thought, hey, maybe it's just me being me. So that's what happens to the second coil here. I changed out the coil when I changed out the flavor. So I tried it again last night. I gotta tell you this. I threw that shit out. I don't like it. Honestly... I'm not trying this brand again. I think it's disgusting. All right. If you guys have any other brands that you guys want to suggest, let me know. If you guys like this brand, let me know. But honestly, I don't like it. These are the ones I like. The Blueberry Slushy. This one is three milligrams. This one is six milligrams. And I notice with the higher doses of the nicotine, the darker the color is. I'm kind of worried about that a little bit. Like, really? This one was completely clear when I bought it. There's still some e-juice in it. It's really clear. So I'm guessing the ones that have no nicotine are 100% clear. I'm going to go to the shop and just buy like a 16 milligram or a 32 milligram bottle to see, just to see how dark it is. That's all I want to see. But this, never again. Garbage, son. All right. Now, as for the atomizer short, which I don't have anymore. All right, this is the smock. 
smoke, smock, whatever you want to call it. Pro color, 225 watts. Now the single coil is what I stuck in this the first time when I when I started using it. After the tank emptied out the first time I used it, it was fine. But when I refilled it, atomizer short, atomizer short, atomizer short. I'm gonna tell you guys like this: find the reason for the short in your system, because I listened to those shortcuts like the it's an easy fix, just unscrew the top. I had flames spitting out from the side. No lie, I put I I filled it up. Had it said atomizer short. Unscrewed the top just a little bit, stuck it to my mouth, pulled the freaking trigger, and what happens? Boof! A flame that came out by like maybe up to here. It scared the shit out of me. And then the burning taste, like, ugh, it's disgusting. All right, if you have an atomizer short, find the root cause of your problem. Quick fix does not work. All right? Either there's something wrong with your coil, the coil's touching. The coils are made by men. Not made by machines, okay? So, if there's something wrong with your coil, you're just going to cause a short. If you have leakage in your tank, it's going to cause a short because there's not supposed to be water touching in the pins on the bottom. Actually, had both issues, all right? Anyway, find the root cause of your issue. If you guys have any questions, let me know about the atomizer short. Let me know what problems you guys are having. Most likely, you just have to change the coil to a new one. But as for the e-juice juices, I hate this shit. Maybe if I blend it, but... I hate it. This one, uh, it's okay. But it's great when I mix it with this. And this one, I love. Keep it 100, blue slushy. Love it. All right. Anyway, hit me up in the comments. Which, which ones did you guys like? Which ones you love? And that explains how this fell out. I just threw it. And this fell out the pack. All right. Which ones you guys love? Which ones you guys hate? Let me know. All right, peace. Oh yeah, if you guys play Injustice and on Xbox, hit me up.